Okay, we are back and we're almost at level 9 and I believe that at level 9 we can unlock our first exotic animals. But first we have a new Chonkin! A new pretty Chonkin, a Hampshire Red. Oh, so pretty! So very pretty. I think we have a new cow as well. We do. A short horn cow. Very epic. So yes, I do quite like the designs of the animals in this game. They are very cute. Especially there's like cows that sit on the floor and they look pretty cute as well. But, you know, it's mainly about leveling up in the early stages it seems. So that we can get all the new stuff. And plus the exotic animals I believe are quite an important part of this game. Um, I really need some field space though. I can fit one extra, but I think I've got more space. So I guess we're going to have to do some redecorating as well at some point. But it also looks like our cows are homeless. Which is obviously not good. Because if our cows are homeless, then they'll just end up dying. No! No! Put the... the put the... Fun Why is it breaking? Put the... Put the baking furnace over here. Can I? Am I allowed? Maybe it's not going to let me for some reason. I guess I'll just throw it over here for now. Oh my goodness. That was way too much of a palaver. Anyway. Should be able to put down my extra field now. So Since we've got a little bit more space. Um, so yeah, I'll just pop it there. Doesn't really matter. But yeah, I guess we need some more locations for these cows to sit. But we'll do that in a second anyway. Let's feed these bad boy chickens up. And feed these... Well, sell these elder cows. And then I think we should be able to get some XP in a second. And then we'll see what the RNG exotic giving gods give us. Because I believe with these exotics it's random. And I really, really still want to get a turtle and a penguin. As soon as I can. Honestly, that's like my main goal in this game. To get a turtle and a, uh, and a penguin. And we did also get an upgrade for M Marie, which is nice, which means that it should be easier to collect the weeds, which is lovely, lovely. Um, oh, there's the XP that we need. Level 9, boy. So there, we get the Ranger Tower, and it looks like we've unlocked Sugar Cane. Oh my god, a Hog Badger. A Hog Badger. You've unlocked your first exotic animal. Very cool. They are a, spe a special type of animal that can be sent on quests. Collect exotic tokens, unlock and train your exotics, send your animals to find rare items. But first, this little cutie needs a home. So, yeah, I guess we buy this exotic animal home for him, which I guess we'll put down here. Let me put it. Oh, it's quite big. In fact, it's kind of huge. Hi, I'm Ranger Jane. We're almost ready to start exploring. We just need to set up my Ranger Tower first. Let's build it now. And then we pop a Ranger Tower. I guess it's so that she can keep track of the animals. Nice. It looks like all these animals are breeding. Everyone's breeding with each other. Can't even keep up. And I'm not sure if I want to unlock that straight away or not. But Win Exotic Animal Quest is apparently one of the tasks that it's asking us to do. So we can now send exotic animals to Wild Quests. They'll return with valuable items if they're strong. Here is the map showing available quests. Let's select one. Here are the details of the current mission. Each quest has multiple missions. Here are the possible rewards if your animals succeed. Let's try this one. Okay, guess we're doing chapter one. In the team selection, we choose which animals will go. Here are your animals. Let's drag it to the slot. He has a cute noise. Beep boop. Now it's time to find the treasure. But it says we've got five attempts. So this would be guaranteed, right? If there's five. Oh, we found the reward. And we got some coins from it. And a gem. Okay. And it looks like we've got five sections of this chapter to do. So we have to do chapter one, then chapter two. Um, now that we've learned the basics, let's learn a bit more about finding. This is the power gauge. It fills as you select animals to the team. You gain one attempt to find the reward for each sector that lights up. With a full gauge, you can get five. Do <clears throat> doing exotic missions costs animal energy. It regenerates automatically. 
So we've got like two different kinds of energy in this game. We can pop our guy here. And again, if we've got five attempts, it looks like that means it's guaranteed. But I imagine if you have weaker animals, then you won't have a guarantee. You've collected a key. Keys can be used to open some of the chests that appear in your farm when clearing weeds, trees, and such. Get keys, use keys to open key chests, and get rewards. No, stickers. We can get stickers for it. Yay! I can put them in my scrapbook. Pop him down. And we got an elixir and some coins. You've collected some exotic elixirs. They can be used to train exotic animals. Let's try. Tap the animal. Tap the info button. Tap the train button. Do I want to be training this guy? I don't know. Um, tap the elixir. Okay. Do they want me to use all three? I guess I have to. Tap the train button. And there we go. Our badger has been upgraded. Like training, level up animals, increase the chance to succeed. Exotic tokens are useful for buying more exotic animals. You can get them by completing boat deliveries. It's a good idea to unlock the boat as soon as possible. Okay, well I guess we're going to be trying to unlock that boat then. So I will unlock that expansion. A level 24 for a water tower? Okay. But yeah, I guess we just try and get lots and lots of exotics so that I can get the, the penguin that I desire. I guess that's what we'll be doing now. But yeah, all I know is that it's RNG as to which ones you get, so I imagine that there's probably some, like, really strong ones. I don't know if you can, like, pay to win to get those. Not that I'm gonna buy them, but... I hope that the RNG chests are kind. Like, please, all I need is a, a, a turtle and a penguin and I'll be happy. I mean, I was not expecting a badger. As the first one, but it said that he was a one star, I think? I don't know how good that is. Like, maybe we need a higher star animal to do some of the harder quests? I don't know, we'll work it out as we get there. I did a little bit more collecting and now it's asking me to tap this merchant building. I don't know why, but it looks like this is more exotic stuff. Let's go to the exotic animal tab. Here you can see varying offers each day. Let's check the contents of this one. You can scroll through the possible animals here. Let's buy this with this silver exotic token you just received. Oh, I must have gotten one of those. Ooh, a wolfie! Hi, wolfie! Look at him, he's like buddy, but fluffier. Ooh, he's fast! So we could add him to our profile if we wanted to. But I'm not going to do that, because I've got pogging chicken right now. Um, it's telling me to click free? An elixir, okay. So either we can get elixirs or animals out of that one, it looks like. And we've got mountain elixirs. Which one has the penguins in it? That's the main thing I'm, I'm concerned about. Okay, we've got some sticker, energy, and a key. Very cool. All the hard work's making me crave something cold and refreshing. A dessert stand would be perfect, especially on days with hot weather. So it looks like we need to unlock a new guy and a new dessert stand, but we can't actually unlock it at this level yet. So we will make our way. We've got another field slot. We are going to have a big field soon before I even know it. Big field! Big field. And I guess we throw some sunflower seeds in. Yeah, that looks like it should do it. And we can also change the look of our... Oh, the bird park looks pretty. I like that. But I think I need those weird ruby things. I don't think the rubies do anything else. Angus! Oh yeah, I must have got him earlier. And there's our grey wolf. So there's our badger, and then we got our grey wolf. And it looks like, even though I haven't leveled him up, he's got a lot more power. I saw a flamingo! OMG, I saw a flamingo. Oh my goodness. I want, like, literally all of those animals in there. Like, genuinely, this does feel more like Zoo Tycoon than Farmville, but I don't even care. Plus, we've got dancing bakers. <laughs> oh, this game is so meme. Oh, I'm so glad. I am so glad I decided to delve into this. Because 
I easily could have just skipped it like I do most mobile games, but oh my goodness. Having a flamingo on my farm? Like, yes please. I'll do it. I wonder if we're gonna get any more animals, like, animal helpers on our farm, like Buddy. Maybe. Maybe not? I guess we'll find out as we keep going. Yes, let's collect all this wood and the dirt. Oh, look at our little, our little wolfie and, our, and the badger in their habitat. How very cute. How very cute. Yeah, I, I always try and make sure I use my energy because it's so easy to just forget about it and then end up leveling up. At least in the early levels. I imagine it won't be as much of a problem later on. Still need a hammer. I'm so tempted to buy the upgrade. Like, why are these so annoying to upgrade the barn and the silo? I guess we sell some of our milk, though, because I have a lot of milk. I think it's because I had loads of cows. Yeah, we could build that now, which is great. And, uh... I guess we just do some more orders now that these have reset. But aside from that, I think we are... We are mostly sorted. Oh, my goodness. Now the silo's full! We need an axe! Ugh. That is such a pain. This has to be one of the most annoying things in this game, is having to deal with the inventory space. Like, you're telling me that entire silo can barely even hold any sunflowers? Okay, game. Okay, game. I guess we'll do a few orders so that then maybe it'll use some of our resources? Oh my. It just never ends. I'll throw some of each, just so that we have some, like, we can make some sugar if we need it, make some sunflower oil if we need it. But I'm interested to see how all of the exotic questing goes. I think we can only get regular animals out of these boxes. Oh, but we can get elixirs. That's nice. Um, let's make him do some brown eggs. Any brown eggers? I probably shouldn't even be selling these sunflowers because they only give me one coin each, which is pretty bad. But I think sunflowers is using like quite a lot of stuff. That's the reason I keep putting it in. Like the feed mainly. I think it's using a lot of the feed. I guess uh, we're done skis for now. Unless we can bake something. We're gonna bake some bread or some carrot cake or an omelet. Let's do the omelet. Let's make two omelets. Yummy, yummy, tasty. Very tasty. But anything else? Oh yeah, we can make some omelets for these um, orders as well. Well, I guess that is uh, that is our little bit of farming for now. Oh, I hate having to wait for these. Why? Why do I have to wait for this wait timer? But at least the sunflowers are coming in handy for this, right? Better than nothing. So here is chapter two. So that does fill up to five, so we can't fail this one. Thank you. And we got a key for that. Can we do another one? Oh yeah, we can do a couple. I wonder if they're going to restrict us to certain animals or something by a certain point. That would be my guess. Why is it not opening? Tap the chest? Okay. That chest was not the same colour as the one that I collected game. Actually BS. So we're on mission four. What do we get? Another key? And then mission five out of six. It looks like we can do this one as well. Wait, four attempts? I don't have a gap. What? Looks like you didn't find it. If the current mission feels too difficult, consider training. And remember, the merchant always has great deals. How did I fail that? I had four attempts. Actually scuffed. That's actually scuffed game. I'm irate. I can't train them. I don't have anything. Wee wee. This is me crying. Well, I guess we need to unlock that boat quickly then. Oh wait, I do have elixirs, don't I? Um, I guess I use the mountain ones on him? Oh wait, I can use any. I can give him any elixir, okay. I guess I'll just level him up to level 2. Okay, we should be able to do that now, then, right? He didn't gain that much power. 
I thought you gained more than that. Strange. Very strange. Well, I guess it's gonna start getting tougher from here, boys, with those quests. Only tougher from here. Soy sauce it is. And I guess we are done skis for now. Pick dopiary. Oh wait, there's one more quest. Can we do this one? A wood and some flour? Okay, I'll do that one as well. Maybe we can get another box unlocked? But yeah, all of our timers are pulling up for now, so I guess we mainly wait until the next exotic quest can be done. And obviously waiting on this truck to come back because we have to wait for it every time. Such a troublesome existence. Such a troublesome existence. I, I am kind of curious to see what we can update on the farm, like the look of everything eventually. It's just like right now we can't really do all that much. Wait for the truck to come in and we deliver this one as well. And we should get a delivery of a new animal. We can get delivery mastery as well. And what is this animal going to be? Come on, come on, truck. Truckington. What have you brought me? Chunkin. A big fatty chunkin. And that takes me up to 10. So that means that we do, in fact, unlock Carlos. Very cool. Hey. So there he is, Carlos Chan. Also doing his dance with the chicken. Chad's looking at him like, what the heck are you doing, dude? Oh, no, he joined him in dancing. Okay, I have no idea what's going on anymore. And I guess we unlocked Boat Harbor? It said we needed the boats to get more exotic stuff, right? I guess? Many new things are unlocking. And I guess we need a dessert stand for Carlos as well. But dessert stands are 1500! Jesus! Well, that's not happening for a long time. <laughs> oh, God. 1500 for a dessert stand? Oh, jeez. I'm guessing they're going to be used. And we need some wood. Okay, at least we got some of our energy back. But these trees are level 2 now. Oh, God, they cost 11 each? Ew! Like, the weeds only give, uh, weeds. So, we don't have a lot of things that give wood, really. Oh, we do have some old trees. I guess we can do those. And then we'll unlock the, the boat, the boat land. And then we will get some of those exotic tokens from that boat area. Baby border! Baby border. Pop some more wheat in. No, I do not want to assign Carlos's profile to my abode, thank you. Is that enough wood yet? Or am I going to have to collect all these? I don't remember. That should be enough, right? Build! Did I not- did I not click the, the button properly? Oh no, I did. Okay, so we've got to wait four hours for the boat check. I'm waiting, game. I'm waiting. I want it. I want more tokens. I want more penguins. I'm so desperate. Do I sound desperate? Because I am. 